Hey! Gobble, gobble! It's turkey time! Hello, my elbows is our awesome platinum turkey roaster. This thing is incredible. So, just like everything else in platinum, that is totally unconventional style of cooking, so are our turkeys. This whole big roaster fits a 24 pound turkey, stuffed, you only time it for about 18 minutes a pound. So you can cook a whole turkey in four hours and 15 minutes on your stove top in vacuum cooking. Having said all that, expressing all my love for the turkey roaster, I'm gonna do our turkey in our wok today. Why? Because I can. <laughs> I'm doing only a 13 pound turkey. I'm not doing a big, big, huge one. So I'd rather do it in my wok and not have to wait four hours. I'm gonna have my turkey in two hours maximum. Follow me. I'm gonna preheat my wok on medium high. So I get my little bubbles, my water bubbles beating up and dancing because we want to sear the bird. Peppering up the inside here, the turkey. And now we're gonna blanch the turkey. And so what blanching does is you'll see, it'll start to tighten up. See that? What that does is locks in all the moisture. Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? Our turkey is stuffed. I've slathered it in butter. You want your butter room temperature so that it's slatherable. I think that's a word. So here's a little bit more of our organic no salt seasoning. And our old favorite, Mr. Spike, tastes phenomenal on a turkey. Put a black pepper. And, and I've got the neck and the gizzards and the liver and the little baby heart all in here because that's gonna make our gravy taste fine. Don't be queasy. Everything matters. Everything counts. Ho, ho, ho! Look at her go. Oh yeah, baby. And while that's searing, we're gonna spice up the back. Get it on both sides. String a little bit of bacon on top of there. A little bit more of our white wine. Maybe like half a bottle. Not too bad. Close this. We preheat our pan. We sear it on the inside of the pan, and then take it out, put our insert back inside, lay the bird up, breasts up, okay? Much better that way, trust me. Since there's no thermal knob, how do you know when to turn it down? Super easy. When the lid starts to spit out a little bit of moisture on the sides, and you'll see it, it'll look like it's kind of floating. That's when you would turn your burner down to just between medium and low. Don't you want to brown the bird when it's done cooking? Yeah. So here's the best thing about platinum. You don't have to transfer it into any kind of a different baking dish. Just like this, the whole pot, turn your stove on to broil, slide this right in, three, four, maybe five minutes broil the top of your bird. Okay, absolutely awesome. Nothing will happen to your cookware. It won't burn or melt. So get it out with your oven mitts, put it back on your counter. This is the part. You lift the bird out, just like that. In here now, you have all the drippings, right? So what else is cool? Our turkey roaster. It has an acuthermic base. Flip it over, charge it up, and after we carve up the turkey, we serve right out of it and it's like a chafing dish. It keeps it warm the whole time, so your guests can keep coming back. Absolutely fantastic. Gobble, gobble, turkey's done. Are you ready? Woo Look at that. Now I've got my broiler on high, so just like this, 
we are going to put it right at the oven. And that's it, guys. Mwah. White wine butter turkey. Does it get any better than this? If you enjoyed this video and you love learning how to do a turkey in platinum, like us, post some comments. We want to hear from you.